Hey, what is going on, guys? It is Sprayden here, back again with another Rocket League car designs. And in this episode, we are going to be doing the fourth episode of the Black Market Decal mainframe. So, if you guys need more mainframe designs, the three other episodes will be in the suggested on the top right, as well as in the link in the description down below. Also, if you guys have not hit the subscribe button, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below to get up to date on my newest Rocket League car design videos. So, let's get right into the first car design with the P sim wheels. So starting off, we have the blue side for we have a sky blue octane for the blue side. Now you guys do not have to use the painted versions. I just have them because I have them. So you guys do not need to use them. But for the orange side, we have the non-painted octane. For the decal, it is mainframe. For the colors, we have a dark blue as the primary. And then for the accent, it is a sky blue. And for the primary, for the orange side, it is a dark orange. And then for the accent, we have a gray. Now for the wheels, they are the gray P-SIMs for the orange side. And then for the uh, blue side, we have the P-SIM wheels. Now these are not, or the normal P-SIM wheels. These are not inverted, so they're just the normal P-SIM wheels. But the reason why I chose the colors, I chose the dark blue and the sky blue because I think that is a great combination, um, especially with these wheels. And it just looks like a really good uh, color design. And then for this side, I didn't want to choose red because obviously I think red wasn't fitting. So that's why I chose that dark orange to get it as close as possible with the P-SIMs. And then the accent is obviously gray because that is the um, color of the P-SIM wheels. wheels. So the, for the boost, for the blue side, we do have the Season 11 Platinum to kind of mix with that accent color. I thought it looked really good, so the mainframe, and then we get into the Season 11 Platinum boost. And then for the orange side, we do have the Season 11 Silver boost. That is the closest gray I could possibly get to the gray mainframe, as well as the P-SIM wheels. Topper antenna goal explosion up to you guys. But for the trail, we do have the black Hackswerve 3 for the orange side. Now, the reason why I chose black, black is because I do not have any gray trails. And I thought black actually looked kind of good um, with the wheels itself. But it was the closest thing I could get. For the blue side, though, we have the sky blue Hackswerve 3. Keeping that sky blue color looking really good with that uh, dark blue and the sky blue. So this is the blue side. As I said, I really like the color scheme on this one because of that dark blue and the sky blue. It matches the wheels really nicely and it looks really good. And then this is the orange side. Trying to match up the P-SIM wheels, but that gray accent color looks really good. So yeah, that is the first car design. Getting into the next one, we do have the Balakara wheels, the titanium white ones. Um, so starting off, we have the normal octane, known patent. If you guys have the painted like titanium white or like cobalt, that, that would look really good But uh, for the decal mainframe. But for the colors, it is a dark blue as the primary. And then for the accent, we have white. And then same with the primary. On the orange side, we have a orange. And then the accent as white yet again. For the wheels, they are the titanium white car wheels for both sides. Uh, the reason why I chose blue on this side is because blue and white usually look really good with all titanium white wheels. But um, now, the this side, I tried to get as close as possible to that copper. Um, you can actually maybe make it a little bit darker. Um, but I tried to get as close as possible to the uh, copper on the ball cars. And then white for both sides to match the ball cars, the titanium white ones. Uh, boost. The boost is the titanium white super magnet bolt 3 for both sides. Keeping it all titanium white and the reason why I chose titanium white super magnet bolt. Uh, just it looked really good. Uh, that's that's really why I like the super magnet bolt 3 titanium white. Topper antenna gold explosion up to you. But for the trail for okay that's not right. For the trail for both sides we do have the Hacksworth 3 on paint it matching it as close as possible yet again with the copper um, you could also run the titanium white uh, hacks Rift 3 or any other titanium white um, boost or trails but that's up to you I like the hacks Rift 3 non painted to get as close as possible with the copper wheels so this is the blue side like I said basically it was just getting that white mainframe the white as the accent 
with the ball car wheels and then the blue matches really nicely on the blue side and then this side for the primary I tried to match the copper as best as possible but that mainframe is really where it stands out Getting into the last and final car design of the episode, we do have the Visionary Wheels. Now, the Visionary Wheels are one of my favorite Rocket Pass wheels. They're just a different type of color. Like, if it's lime, it's, like, you know, a darker lime or a darker pink. So, that's why I really do like the Visionary Wheels. For the blue side, we do have a lime octane. And then for the pink side, we do have the, or for the orange side, we do have the pink octane. But like I said, guys, you guys do not have to rock the painted versions. Uh, decal is mainframe. For the colors, we have a dark green as the primary. And then the accent is a lighter green. And then for the orange side, we do have the dark pink. Matching with the light pink as the accent. For the wheels, they are the pink, or the normal visionary wheels, sorry, um, the normal visionary wheels for the orange side. And then for the blue side, we do have the lime visionary wheels. Now, obviously, the reason why I chose these colors, the dark lime and the light lime are one of my favorites. And then for this side, the pink is a little bit darker, and then we have that light pink going throughout the car, which I really do like. So that is why I chose those colors. For the boost... For the lime color, for the blue side, we do have the lime radiant gush. Uh, I love radiant gush because of the uh, lime, and then it gets dark towards the end, so that's what my goal here was. And then for this side, we do have the pink radiant gush yet again uh, because of the pink as well as it getting darker in the back. Top right antenna, goal explosion, up to you. But for the trail, for the pink side, or for the orange side, we do have the classic trail. I don't have any pink boost, so I don't want to, like, I just use the classic trail for that side. But then for the blue side, we do have the Lime Hackswerve 3. Um, so, yeah, this is the blue side. My favorite thing about this is definitely the color scheme as the wheels go perfectly with it. So this is definitely my favorite car to, uh, like, to use. I don't use it very often, but, you know, it looks really good. And then for this side, we have the pink side, which is obviously getting that darker pink with the light, lighter pink, which the color scheme just looks really, really good. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please leave a like and subscribe for more. I'll see you guys in the next episode.